mind and energy. Um, we all are a living energy. We're all connected. And um, when you start acting more like what you want to become, when you start getting life back in you, when you start playing the part of what you want to become, when you start living the part of what you want to become, that's when the magic starts to happen. Um, it's so important that we all stop worrying so much about what other people think and worrying about what other people are doing and overanalyzing people and things. Once we learn to stop analyzing other people and things in life, that's when you really start to feel the more joy for life. When we're able to stop analyzing things and analyzing people and worrying about the past or worrying about people and the past and letting our brains go back to the past, that makes us depressed. It makes us feel more vulnerable and insecure. It brings up insecurities. So when we're able just to pass on a thought of, of thinking about other people, worrying about other people, taking other people's inventory, it brings a, a, a very big rush of energy into our brains and our you know, conscious minds. Um, when we're able to, because we're able to have more energy and love and stuff for life. When we say no to negativity and we ignore the uh, more negative things in life and we concentrate on today and concentrate on what we want in our lives, that's when we start to shine. It's so important to realize and to remember that our thoughts are connected to our future and that you can break through depression and anxiety using the laws of attraction by visualizing what you want in your life, what you want to be, who you want to be around, what do you inspire to be in life? What brings you joy and happiness? And it starts with stopping taking your inventory and other people's inventory. And once you're able to do that, you're going to start feeling a lot more abundant and powerful. Because once we're able to stop, start ignoring negative people and negative things in life and start focusing more on what we want in life, boy, that's when the power really comes to be because that's when we have a lot more energy for ourselves. And that's why it's so important too to have gratitude, to be grateful for what you have and to be, have passion. It brings you more passion in life. It gives you more energy to do the things you really want to do in life, right? Instead of concentrating on negative things, drama or resentment, instead you put all your energy into fine-tuning yourself in what you want in life, right? Instead of worrying about what other people think. And you'll start, as soon as you start practicing on um, not concentrating on what other people think or negativity in life you're going to find so, feel so much more happy and so much more abundant and it's, it's you're going to be very surprised all it takes is step by step uh you know remembering to filter out the negative thoughts and not paying attention to the negative thoughts and letting your mind go to overanalyze and taking people's inventory and taking your own inventory and beating up on yourself, which helps nobody, right? So remember, be more present in the moment. Be aware of your thoughts. Avoid negative thinking and stay positive. Remember, the power of the mind, our belief systems, everything. And what we think, what we do, we become. And we can, you can become anything you want to become in this life. It's all about how we think. All about how we think. Please subscribe. Hope everyone has a great day. Remember, filter out the negativity in life. And don't worry about what other people think. Just concentrate on today and the positivity and the love in life. Bye.